I'm Sarah Birch with Kingsness News, and here's your top headlines today, December 14th, 2023. The OPP have provided more details about two motor vehicle collisions involving an officer with the LNA County Detachment. OPP Media Relations Officer Acting Sergeant Aaron Miller confirmed that OPP attended a three-vehicle collision on Thursday, November 30th, 2023, where two OPP vehicles were involved. As a result of the investigation, he confirmed that a 42-year-old Lennox and Atchison County Detachment member was charged with careless driving under the Highway Traffic Act on Tuesday, December 12th, 2023. With the colder winter weather beginning to set in throughout eastern Ontario, those experiencing homelessness are forced to find ways to stay safe and warm during the long, cold winter nights. Mindful of the difficult circumstances many find themselves in at this time of year, one local musician is once again stepping up to ensure people have warm clothing. For seven years, Tim Sheffield, a.k.a. Clem Chesterfield, has organized the Warm Clothes Roundup, an annual holiday concert in support of the Kingston Street Mission. This Sunday, December 17, 2023, the concert returns for its seventh year at the mansion, located at 506 Princess Street. The Kingston Police Street Crime Unit concluded a lengthy investigation into the psychedelic mushroom dispensary Shroomies, located in downtown Kingston on Tuesday, December 12, 2023. Transit riders and pedestrians may have noticed the colorful storefront in the 100 block of Brock Street in downtown Kingston. A quantity of Canadian currency, signage, and a significant quantity of psychedelic mushroom products were seized with a value of approximately $49,000. On January 11, 2023, Empire Life celebrated its 100th anniversary. To honor that milestone, the company launched a grant program encouraging employees to nominate and vote for charities across the country, and two local charities have been selected for that award. The 10 registered charities who reached the final round after nominations and voting each received a $10,000 donation for a total donation of $100,000 as part of the Empire Cares Grant Challenge. Two teams of local healthcare professionals have been awarded a total of over $80,000 for their respective projects through the Elaine and Michael Davies Award for Innovation. This was the inaugural year for the Davies Award for Innovation and 18 applications were submitted, with two being chosen, one involving a Kingston Health Sciences Centre proposal and the other a Providence Care proposal. For more details on this story and other local news, please visit kingstonist.com and subscribe. Use my code SARAB2023 for 10% off.